Okay, so I don't know if you can see this, but, um, okay, so this is going to be a video about how to do a, a um, successful cord cutting ceremony. So basically what you need to do is, obviously, as you can see, I just done mine. So I'm not showing myself on, my, on the camera today because I'm in my pyjamas, I look correct. I just wanted to share this with you because... I've been feeling emotional and I just feel like my um, obsession is just slowly starting to get the, the better of me again and I paid a lot of money for therapy and I don't have that kind of money to do it all over again. So I rely on my spirituality to help me through hard times. So what we do is, what we do is we... Obviously, this is not meant to be. This is not meant to be in the in the middle just yet. I know that you can see some ash over there. Um, that's from. I'll explain why in a minute. So, I tried at first. I told myself I'm gonna stay clear with the whole spiritual realm. I don't want. I mean, not stay clear of it, but just like don't showcase it on my channel because I don't know how. You know, I know there's a lot of people talking about it on you, their YouTube channels, but I'm not too sure. I wasn't too sure about how my subscribers would respond to it. But to be honest, this is the perfect ritual for if you're, for example, if you're obsessed with someone or you're, you're obsessing over a situation. For example, you've got a bill and you're just obsessing over it that, oh, my God, I don't have this kind of money, but blah, blah, and your mind is just on it. Or if you're obsessing over a pass, or if you're obsessing over a breakup, or if you're just like obsessed over someone who don't want you, like this is the perfect ritual to do. So anyway, I've been writing, and you know I'll get into that another time. But I've been writing, and I got to a point where I got to a certain point in in my story and it just brought back so many memories and I just been feeling a bit down today I mean I relapsed the other day um and you know you could read it's not about alcohol or drugs guys you can relapse with anything where I could say oh I'm gonna work out every single day and then you know, come Wednesday, I re relapse because I didn't work out on the Wednesday. You know, it's that a relapse is when you're trying to a relapse is when you're trying to um, achieve something or you're trying to um, to do good and then you just flop. You know, like that's a relapse. So I relapse, and so I'm gonna to explain to you how what you do. So what you do is. As you can see, I've got a circle, and these are, um, it's all right for me to pick up now because my, it's finished, but these are these cute little flowers from my um, rose, no, not rosemary, from my uh, mint plant. You know, when you grow mint over time, and you just start, and the flower starts to bloom, and it looks pretty. Anyway, I just trimmed some of my plant, and then... I thought, you know what, I'm going to do a ritual. It's usually best to do a plant that you've been growing yourself. Like, not just like, oh, well, I bought it like this at the shop and I'm going to do it right now. No, wait till you trim it and then it regrows. And then when you trim it again, that's what you grew yourself. So it's almost like you're, just like you created this sort of situation that you're struggling with you also created this plant so you've got a good thing and you've got you know something that's making you struggle and so what you do is you it could it doesn't have to be flowers it could literally be leaves it could be flowers it could be anything I mean if you don't grow something and you just want to go out into the garden and just like grab anything you can do that but it might not be as it might not be as um effective as if you've grown it yourself because obviously the situation that I'm in you know it's fair to say some people would look at it and say well you know you started this <laughs> you know it started with you and my plant is something that I grew so you make a circle, not a huge circle, but a circle big enough for you to sit in. And obviously you don't need you don't need that yet. 
So you sit in the circle and you play music. Um, the mus music therapy is so underestimated. And it's not about any spiritual, it's not about sound bars. I mean, like you can use sound bars, you can use um, just normal pop songs, you can use any song that relates to your situation, you know, that's got such a grip on you, that's so relatable. And you sit there and you meditate. You meditate and you, when you go in the circle, make sure you do not break the circle as well. So you meditate. And you just say, for example, say if I'm, for example, say if I'm obsessed with someone, right? So I play all these songs about, oh, I miss you, blah, 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 whatever. And, you know, for example, You Are The Reason by Leona Lewis, you know, you could play any, you could play whatever song you, you feel like playing. You could play like two songs, you could play ten songs. And when you've had enough, as soon as you've had enough, by the way, you come out of the circle, yeah, without breaking the circle. You come out of the circle and you turn off your music. And by the way, the whole time, make sure your music is low to the ground so that the music radiation is, you know, going into the floor and, you know. So anyway, so I'm going to show you what you use. So, this... These are these cute little incense that I bought. I bought these like a few months ago. Yeah, so there's incense and you put it in here and you put it in the centre. And what you want to then do is play the sort of music that... Play a song, either a song or just keep playing music that you wish you could... Like, for example... You're out of the circle, so you've left all the, all those thoughts inside the circle, yeah. And you want to you what you want to do is you want to now reverse. You now want to you know like while the insect is burning, so you put this in the middle, just like it was in the middle. And while that's burning, like it may take like an hour, it may take however long it takes, but you want to play powerful music you know like you want to play music you know that will let you know that you're going to get through this that this doesn't own you that your situation that you're going through it's not it doesn't own you also another thing do not open the window because you want you want the chips to basically just fall where they may you know when you're you know when incense just like um starts to crumble and fall off and everything you know like when the ash starts to fall you just want it to you want everything to be natural you don't want anything to manipulate this yeah and it's also important to just watch the smoke what you're watching is your problems burning yeah and just really vision that and when you see the smoke separating you know into two columns that's when you really know that okay this is over and when you're finally, when you're finally, finally, finally finished and you finish playing all the music to let you know you're going to get through this, what you do is you leave everything how it is, you open a window and you step out the room and you just let nature just carry your problems outside. And then by the time, like wait like half an hour or wherever, by the time you get, by the time you get, um, <laughs> yeah, by the time you come back to your room, your room wouldn't be all smoky and everything, everything would just be normal and you just see that as your problem's gone now, it's out the window, you literally watched your problem burn and now it's out the window. I kept it like this because I wanted to show you what to do. So, you know, I mean, like this could be, you could do this if you have an illness. You could do this if you're obsessed with someone. You could do this if, you know, you you've got a bill when you're stressed. You could do this if you're you just had a really bad day and your manager just like made you feel really crappy. You could do this if you got bad news from the doc. You could do this about anything. So. I've, after doing this, I feel I feel a lot better now. 
Um, so I'm in my PJs, that's why I'm not showing you because yes, I've been in my pyjamas all day. It's Monday and I don't work so I can be in my pyjamas all day. <laughs> so I've been in my pyjamas all day and yeah. <laughs> so basically, so there's the perfect cord cutting ceremony um, that's done safely. Um, it's, it's a safe cord cutting ceremony. And yeah, it's perfect. It's perfect for anyone. I mean, so yeah. I mean, obviously, if the obviously if like there's adverts, you just press skip ad. You don't have to like panic if you know like YouTube adverts comes on between your music. Just as long as you press skip ad or whatever. But yeah, that's all really. And I just feel so much better. I feel like weight has been lifted off and yeah sorry i did i'm posting so late i've had i've had problems with the wi-fi but i'm gonna post this like now it's like 10 at night i think something like that and i'm just gonna try and upload this now so anyway um i will see you guys later and good luck with your cord cutting ceremony like comment and subscribe